Nick, well, old Highway 91 is now old Dixie Highway 91 in Washington County. Just three weeks ago, Washington County commissioners unanimous, unanimously approved to rename it. This comes after Dixie State University changing their name to Utah Tech University to remove the ties to the Confederacy that come with the word Dixie. ABC 4 Southern Utah correspondent Jordan Verdadero spoke to residents in Southern Utah about the road's name change. In late January, Commissioner Gil Almquist proposed a resolution to change Old Highway 91 to Old Dixie Highway 91. I think that was an egregious thing. Janice Brooks is a resident in Ivins. She says she was shocked to find the name change for the popular highway was unanimously approved by Washington County Commissioners. One of the first and foremost reason, reasons for me is that highway runs through the Shilowitz Reservation. Not only have you taken a heritage away from a people that have inhabited that area, and then you have renamed it something that identifies with your own identity. It's another form of colonization in a modern form. Commissioner Almquist says he wanted to rename the highway that runs through the county to remember the pioneers who settled during the Civil War. They wanted to be independent from all the outside needs, one of which being cotton. They became known as Utah's Dixie. As you know, there have been some controversial comments about Dixie in the name, but this was purely an agricultural sort of designation because of where we were, the hot climate. Dixie State University will soon officially be Utah Tech University after controversy arose from students and staff due to the word Dixie's tie to the Confederacy during the Civil War. Almquist says it wasn't meant to be controversial, but wanted Old Dixie Highway 91 to remember local history. Educate yourself. Educate your children. Do not die ignorant. Reporting in Hurricane, Jordan Verdadero, ABC4 News. All right, thank you, Jordan. Well, more developing news right now. The